there guys, welcome to my gaming channel. This is Mirrorless Action and a brand new function within Mirrorless Action that allows you to capture gameplay from directly from your console as long as you've got a capture card connected of course. Now it replaces your capture card software um, and the reasons for that is two reasons I can think of. One is a zero latency and another one it records lossless quality video. Alright, so in order to get this working, obviously this drop down list here, I've got the AvaMedia GC550, which is also known as the Live Gamer Extreme, it captures at 1080p 60fps maximum. And uh, there's that noise again. Yeah, don't you dare interrupt me again! <laughs> I'm pleading, you know, that buzzing you get from interference with the phone. Anyway, um, I've gone completely off what I was saying. Right, yeah. What we got here is record webcam or USB four stroke HDMI HDMI capture devices. Now this this screen, if you click the bottom right hand side here, you can make it bigger. Let's go to about there. Yeah. Now watch this. Right, 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 right. You know it's virtually uh, lossless when it comes to uh, you know the latency. There's no there's no real latency that I've, I, I can I can see when I'm actually uh, you know doing this. Let's just take it back down to how it was. I prefer it to you know I, I like painstakingly make it the same size as the the console. Well, the interface, I should say. All right, all similar. Right, so what you will find when you get when you see this initially, you will see no signal. In order to correct that, I mean, don't know why it does this. Maybe it's an early, early teething problem with this because this is brand new. I go back there, default. Now, with the Ava Media, you'll get signal out of range. I don't know with the Elgato what you get. If you if, if it if it picks up the Elgato, great. If it doesn't, then obviously this tutorial is not for you. But I think eventually it will do any capture card that's plugged in you go from default and now you got to re realize it it'll it's all depending on what your you know your console and your tv is outputting at the time if it was 720 say if i had a playstation 3 connected a lot of games are 720p so i'd select that one and here well it wouldn't say that you'd, show, you'd see the game screen but it's mine is a PlayStation 4 Pro running in boost mode. And you have to select that one, of course. And there we go, there's a screen. So if you're having that problem where there's no screen, just do what I just did there. And if you still got a problem, then um, I wish I could help you. I'd, I'd have to be there and actually go through the problem myself and see why, you know. But uh, it might this might not work for all capture cards currently as yet because it's like it's, it's only just been introduced really this actually saying that tell a lie it has been introduced in previous versions of uh, mirrorless action but not like this this is more of a serious attempt at recording console gameplays um i've got some gameplays actually i could show you let's double click this one this is my brand new creation vin diesel i'm going to feature him against jason statham Let's double click it. He's trying to uh, break my arm here. He's gonna sit back. All right, he's free. <coughs> Caught him with a punch. You're good here, bro. See, President Dana White loves two men willing to bring it. I think these guys are getting fight of the night bonus for sure. Joey did a nice job blocking that punch. He connects with the hook to the head. That's Statham against Vin Diesel. If you want to see that fight, let me know. A lot of people watch my um, game UFC 2 Game Face videos, and that'll be my latest celebrity death match. So let me know if you want to see it, and I'll post it. I'll put all the, all the bells and whistles, you know, the intros and everything, like I normally do. But anyway, that is a typical example of just how high the quality is on this. And you might have seen... It not look as good as I've seen it because what you're watching is a recording made by AMD's Relive software, which captures at 50 megabytes a second. So it's not that good. It's not that great, you know. Plus, 
you will have seen it then uh, interpolated to 60 frames a second which makes all my 30 fps games look so much better i recommend it to anybody if you if, if you've ever heard of me gui then it's a, it's a program a utility you can download for free i'll leave a link in the description to the, the guy whose video introduced um an installer for this program it's a fabulous program and it doesn't cost you anything if you want your 30 fps gameplays looking like 60 fps gameplays then you know give it a try it's, it's really really good and if you want your videos to stand out as well you know it's another reason to do it but anyway this is recording your console with Marillis action using the brand new record usb capture device option right now last but not least is the audio i'm gonna get to the audio now in order to record audio this is what i've got to do i mean there's something i might be doing something wrong but but when i try just selecting all the different audios there's the microphone there system default system default i've gone through all the available options and it still won't record audio no matter what i do i've got um re always record so it should always record the microphone what i found i've had to do is run a 3.5 milli millimeter jack from my TV head you know the headphone socket on the TV the other end of the, the lead has got to go it's got like 3.5 milli jack on both sides you know both ends of the cable you know the head basically a headphone jack and you plug the other end in to your microphone socket and recording devices when you go into that it's see there there's, there's my microphone at the moment I've got the microphone CAD audio which is my mic my my you know commentary mic and you can see that that's the default device otherwise you won't be hearing me talk but this one is what I would be I right click and I'm sorry no one I I'd highlight it and press set default to record the sound from the game so you're getting first class video and first class audio and that's the way I've I found how to, you know, how can do it. Okay, so I'm going to leave you with uh, a bit of um, PlayStation 3 gameplay, and this is re recorded losslessly. It's a bit of Killzone 3, which I'm a massive fan of. I'm not even, I mean, even though my background screen is uh, Horizon Zero Dawn, I've not even played the game because I want zero, I want um, Guerrilla Games to get back into doing this game. The one and only Killzone 3, I love it. He won't stay still. There we go. There's nothing more satisfying than sniping the guy out of the uh, the mech. You know, it's hard to do, even in bot zone. That's uh, do another one. Oh, wrong, wrong one, wrong one. This is one. One of the fan favorite maps of this game. Lossless quality video, it's, it's, it looks fantastic. He blows some hell gas up. Kill the Higgs! Still, for me, one of the best online shooters I've ever played personally. But anyway, that's recording console, which just goes to show you can record your Xbox One, Xbox 360, your PlayStation 3, PlayStation 4, PlayStation 4. PlayStation 4 Pro. I'm not so sure about the Nintendo consoles, but uh, I've never really got into them because I've, I've never really been into Nintendo. But, you know, see what you can do with that one. Well, this is recording your console with realist action. It's, in my case, it's better than Ava Media's Record Central 3. No offense to Ava Media, I think they make great capture cards. And they're very, uh, you know, they, they look great and they record great, but the software lets them down. Seriously bad. The amount of times that I've had a gameplay totally fucked up because that's totally fucked up, you know, and crashed, it's, uh, it's a criminal. It's it's just sad to see. So I use this now. This captures all my console gameplay, right? If you're still having problems, then I'll try and help you out. Just, just message me or 
put a comment down down below you know anyway i think i've covered everything there this is recording your console with Morelis action give it a try it's uh it works for me and i hope it works for you catch you later